Hey everybody, and welcome back to my little internet house. I've been watching a bunch of Darman videos on stream at twitch.tv slash Jarvis Johnson, always be plugging. And that inspired me to seek out more similar content, you know, for my health. But to my complete and utter surprise, I found a channel that is fully copying the Darman formula but I think it's doing it better. Dar man, I think you have some competition on Dar hands. The channel, I should, I'm gonna take off my glasses. We don't, I don't need to see. The channel is called Zvoid Studios and they create short movies about life, business, and relationships and they hope you like them. Also, don't forget to subscribe. From the looks of it, they are very easy to mistake for Darman videos. I feel like they have, they're using exactly the same thumbnail style with the same text. These videos are meant to show up in the sidebar against a Darman video and for the viewer to have no idea that Darman didn't make this video. And I think they succeed at that. But there's one, there's one difference between the Zvoid Studios videos and the Darman videos that make Zvoid's videos superior in my eyes. Uh, and that's that everybody has superpowers in the Zvoid videos. They're Darman videos with like a moral and stuff, but everyone has magical powers for some reason. There's uh, random people who sit on park benches who have mystical powers. Thank you. You're very welcome. But my time here is, uh... There's, uh, uh this child wizard, <laughs> I presume. And we've got the video that was my introduction to this channel that is just, ooh, ooh, you know? And it's called, Kid Found Out He Can Freeze Time. What happens next will shock you. Let me explain why this is my favorite video on YouTube. For starters, the title, Kid found out he can freeze time. What happens next will shock you. Uh, the first half shocked me already. Was the first half not shocking enough? The, uh, so a kid can freeze time, okay? I don't think what happens next is really going to do, is really gonna do much. Uh, I'm already shocked. And before we jump into the video, just look at the sidebar. Zvoid Studios, and then a Darman video that just fits in there. Like, who's, who's who? I can't tell, I took off my glasses like two minutes ago. Eddie, you can't expect me to do everything. It's impossible like this, do you understand? Why do you always put the blame on me? I'm tired of the fighting all the time. Okay, the stage has been set. We've got dramatic music, we've got a kid reading a, who's clearly a Marvel fan. I mean, just look at his room. It looks like a, oh, I'll be honest, it looks like a guest room that somebody just put a bunch of Spider-Man posters around, <laughs> but it's a, it's a child's room, trust us. And we can hear the distant arguing of, um, of our protagonist's parents. Uh-oh. But all I hear from you is blame and criticism and blame and criticism. And you know what? I'm tired of hearing it. Just stop it. Oh, sweetie, I didn't know you were here. Uh, took you long enough. I heard everything. You do know that we live together, right? <laughs> you guys are just having this argument in the middle of the living room. Um, and I was trying to read Spider-Man. Have you finished homework? Do you need help with it? I finished it. So immediately, one thing that jumps out at me is that the three members of this family have wildly different accents and i just want to understand how that works the kid is like british the mom is vaguely eastern european and then the dad is like southern american have you finished homework do you need help with it i finished it okay son are you, are you hungry? Son, are you hungry? I finished it. How was homework? It's a it's a real United Nations household we've got going on here. I don't want any food. He's like, come on, dad. You know I'm, you know I'm on keto. Ed, we can't continue like this. Not only we hurting ourselves. So our protagonist, um, I want to say his name, but I don't know if they 
they've said it yet, is trying to go to sleep, but unfortunately for him, his parents' arguments are being pi piped into his room via loudspeaker. Like his whole house is bugged. Ed, we can't continue like this. Not only are we hurting ourselves, we're hurting Neil. I agree with you. Like, is, are they arguing at his bedside? Or, or are the walls made of paper? This is not really happening. It's just not happening. Even he's loud. All the fighting, the screaming. I wish I had superpowers. And guess what? His wish may or may not be granted. Let's keep watching. I wish... I wish I had superpowers and I could stop all this. Is he giving like a monologue to nobody right now? Or like to whomever he's wishing for his superpowers? Dear uh, Stan Lee, <laughs> I wish I had superpowers. I wish I could stop. I wish I could stop. I wish I could stop all of the fighting and stuff. Emphasis on stop. Are you Stan? Honey, how was school? It was okay. Great. Dad made the mashed potatoes with a sauce you like. I'm not so hungry. I'm, d I'm, look, let, let me just real quick be clear. I've gotten a couple of comments on my videos where people are like, he's making fun of these like small, he's like picking up out these like random details of this video to make fun of. That's what I'm here to do. If you don't want to watch me uh, take issue with very small elements of this video, like dad made mashed potatoes with the, the sauce that you like, <laughs> I'm sorry, everybody. I'm going to ask what sauce are they talking about? Because mashed potatoes are traditionally only eaten with one sauce. So if you aren't coming here for my gravy questionnaire <laughs> or my gravy conspiracy theories, um, why aren't they saying, why aren't they saying gravy? What sauce is it? I'm sorry. I'm sorry if that hurts somebody's, somebody's feelings. Somebody who eats their mashed potatoes with ketchup. Um, or something. Dad made the mashed potatoes with a sauce you like. Dad made the mashed potatoes with hollandaise sauce. Dad made the mashed potatoes with, uh, sweet baby rays. Dad made the mashed potatoes with, uh, 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 <laughs> Thai chili? Honestly, this sounds good. We we should, you know what? This is this video brings up a great point. We should be we should be experimenting more with our mashed potatoes. What sauce do you like on your mashed potatoes? Let me know in the comments down below. It's too bad. It's really tasty. Where did you come from, Dad? <laughs> he like just appeared. It's really tasty. Did somebody talk about my taters? You'll be regretting it if you don't eat my taters. <laughs> uh, they're delicious, especially with um. A1 <laughs> on it. A1 sauce. That's that's what we eat here on the, That's my son's favorite sauce. Your mother and I want to sit and have a talk with you. Yes, honey. Come. Neil, first, we want you to know that we really love you. Yes, sweetie. And remember that you're not to blame for anything. You know that, don't you? Don't say it. Why did they get on the floor to deliver the news? It looks like they're about to propose together simultaneously. No matter what happens, no matter what you decide, son, Neil, we'll still be a family. But do you want to be a weird family? Oh, just kidding, son. It's a divorce. Our marriage is broken. I don't want to hear. Sweetie, you will eventually have to hear this. And it's better to hear it in a loving environment. It's better to hear it in a loving environment? What are the other environments that he could hear this in? He's riding to school um, and they've got the radio on and it's like, in other news, your mom and dad got divorced. Wish you could have heard this in a loving environment, kid, but, <laughs> but the world is harsh sometimes. No, 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 we're just kidding. It's, this is nice, this is nice, but obviously, Obviously, very traumatic on a child. If only there was some way to stop it. To stop it, you know, like a double meaning, like metaphorically stop it, or like like literally stop it, like with time. He's gonna freeze time, I can feel it. That's my superpower, is like, <laughs> it's like I, I have like a niche superpower where I can just tell when somebody's gonna freeze time. Uh, it doesn't really come into, <laughs> it doesn't really come into much use often, but today's, look, today's my day. You know, your mother and I are getting a divorce. Stop! <laughs> what if they were like, 
Oh, is this a bad time for our miming routine? Okay, well, we'll show you later, son. But, you know, we have hobbies too. This is not funny. I did this. I, I, I froze you. I, I, I have superpowers. This is awesome. He's like a little bit too excited about his moment. Also, still talking to no one. This is awesome. I managed to stop you from saying that, but... Oh, this is amazing. <laughs> I have emotional whiplash from watching this scene. He's like, ah, what have I done? This is amazing. I'm all powerful. I'm I'm a god. Oh, ooh, I ooh, I did. This is is I got myself into quite a predicament. But I this is so cool. Hello. Oh, so he didn't he didn't freeze time. He just like froze. He just froze people unless uh unless the the rules of freezing time mean that you can still get like telemarketer calls hello hi this is carol from wells fargo we've just been made aware that you froze your parents sorry for your loss by the way um on the bright side this qualifies you for a new low interest rate loan <laughs> yeah but we'll have to play in the room because the living room it's a little bit busy right now <laughs> Bye. <laughs> this kid is a savage. He, he just froze his parents not 30 seconds ago. And he's like, yeah, Sandra, come over. Let's play, let's play Among Us. I've got time. I've got... I, looks, at, looks at his frozen parents. I've got all the time in the world. Bye. I'm in the kitchen. What brand of... <laughs> this popcorn... Why does this popcorn look like it's, uh... <laughs> it's like an Amazon Prime package. Oh my god, now what happened to your parents? Tiffany, I have superpowers. I always felt it, and now it actually happened. He's like, I know. I'm a, I'm a pretty big deal. Uh, this must be hard for you. I will I will take you to junior prom, but uh, please no pictures. <laughs> anyway, I do have to figure out how to unfreeze my parents because this is a. Uh, but I do I want to get a little gaming in first. Neil, how can you make popcorn in a time like this? You, for all you know, your parents are frozen forever, and you're just like. Look, my hands are tied. <laughs> I've got a, I've got some forts tonight. This is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Why is everybody so <laughs> nonchalant about frozen parents? They're like, huh? <laughs> well, this is sick. Let's go to the game room. What are you waiting for? Hand me my popcorn. But but how did it happen? Why did you do this? Uh, I don't uh, remember. Exactly. I was kind of mad with power, and I lost sight of myself, so... Anyway, do you want popcorn? What do you mean you don't remember? It, it just happened. <laughs> He's like, I didn't kill my parents. It was a mistake. Alright, good enough for me. Hand me my popped corn. Stop! <laughs> I got scared. <laughs> Why did he yell? She moved. She walked five feet. Not even that. She's like barely left the doorway. <laughs> it's like you asshole. You made me spill my popcorn. Why? Why would you do that? <laughs> you are unhinged right now, my dude. Okay, red is mad sus. Are you serious? It's yellow. No, no, no. A. It's always red. I'm voting red. Wait, they're actually playing Among Us. <laughs> so why'd you do it? <laughs> She's really not letting it go. Um, I don't remember exactly. Just remember I wanted them to stop talking. He's like sticking to his story. He's like, look, I have no idea. What are you gonna do about it? About what? Your parents. Who's gonna sign the school stuff for you? Yeah, who's gonna sign this? That's the question? I'll sign it. Who's gonna prepare meals for you? I'll make it. Look at the delicious popcorn I've made for us. Who's gonna give you hugs when you need them? I like the way this girl thinks. <laughs> She's like, okay, question one. Who's gonna sign permission slips? <laughs> question two, who's, who's giving the hugs? All right, I have two concerns. Listen, I understand, okay? I didn't want my parents to get a divorce either. Why did you say that? Who told you they were getting a divorce? 
Who told you they were divorcing? Oh shit, I wrote the script. My other power is um, that I can predict the script of this video. They're very, very seldom useful powers that I have. Listen, it's obvious. Everybody knows they won't stop fighting. Everybody knows. Everyone can hear them. Their their arguments are piped to the entire town. <laughs> They're just we all have those speaker systems that just play their loud ass arguments in our bedroom. That's why you froze them, right? You don't know what you're talking about. This is a hundred percent a villain origin story. You can't just this kid, like, he keeps smiling like he's about to go mad with power. <laughs> Wanna know how I got these popcorn burns? You can't just free zone your problems away. Stop saying those things. I know what I'm doing. You need to face the fact that your parents are getting a divorce. <laughs> the... I just want to point out that these, like, these dramatic drums are building. Like, there's a guy, like, <laughs> right off <laughs> right off the camera just, like, beating beating a drum right there. Or Ah, he seriously needs to stop yelling. It is it is actually scaring me every time. <laughs> this is like that Eric Andre meme. Tiffany, Tiffany, are you okay? Why would someone do this? I don't believe Froze you too. Okay, well, you, you clearly have a have a temper problem. You like go from zero to stop. Please come back, please. Listen, if you keep doing this, if you keep freezing people however and whenever you want, you will be alone forever. But if I freeze them, they can never leave. Think about it, Samantha, Tiffany. <laughs> What's your name? Bye. Bye, Tiffany. See you later. See you. <laughs> wait, wait, what? They were at the heat of their conflict, and then it's like, all right, peace out, Boy Scout. You were right. Red was sus. Anyway, I'll see you next week. Why do you stop loving each other? All right, <laughs> back to my frozen parents. I'm afraid that someday you'll stop loving me too. Please come back. I don't know why it's so creepy that their hands just come into frame. <laughs> like I feel like they're zombies that are like <laughs> like gonna pull him gonna pull him under. <laughs> they were like, son, we we were just telling you we got a divorce. Why are you laughing? <laughs> what is why are you look so happy about this? Neil, we are going to get a divorce. But that doesn't mean that we stop loving you. And it doesn't mean that we stop being a family. I guess technically speaking, we stop being one family and maybe we splinter off into two families, but we're still like, if you think about it, a part of the same family unit. Why are you still laughing? Yes, sweetie. We'll go through it together because we can't stop being your parents. No matter how hard we try, we can't stop being your parents. That almost sounds like a threat. Like, you may be able to stop us in time, but you can't stop us being your parents. That's what I'm most afraid of, us not being a family anymore. We'll be a better family now. We love you. Don't you forget that. I love you too. <laughs> And that's the video. That wasn't so bad, right? I mean, like, I feel like they avoid most of the pitfalls that Darman gets into, where he, like, just jumps into a, a, the video at the end and goes, it was at that moment that Neil discovered that family was the friends he made along the way. Anyway, we're not just telling stories, we're changing lives. Like, that That stuff was just, like, not there. And, so the, and then the story also wasn't super... I don't know. It didn't play. I mean, the thing about the superpowers is that they don't play on any weird existing, like, traumas in the world. So it's just like, oh, it's a divorce story, but with with time stopping. Okay. That's, that's cool, I guess. I'm not mad at it.
thanks to Saint Zaya or Saint Zaya for sending me a message on Instagram and recommending a video from Zay that I included in my last video. Um, I have no idea if I'm saying that right. If you want me to butcher your name, because I'm sure I butcher that one, you can. Uh, 